everybody's doing great. This is Fuad from Fuad uh, the Texas channel. Today we're gonna talking about uh, a big issue that facing a lot of people lately, uh, which is a come most of the time from uh, the Android version that we have in until we uh, we're gonna be waiting for a new update to fix that issue. The problem that I'm going to be talking about today is the message that we keep all getting. It shows like uh, you're out of the storage, so you can't uh, keep watching um, what, uh, whatever you're watching uh, with any issues. Uh, the problem that I'm talking about is the message keep popping up here or anywhere on the TV and it blocking you from, you know, streaming what you have on the TV. And uh, to fix that problem, we need a couple of things like this, an extension that you're supposed to plug to that little dongle like this. This is the uh, TiVo Stream 4K. And also this is the hub from T-Mobile. So if you have one of these boxes or any other box that has short of storage, like these boxes, it came with eight gig 4 gig is already used for their, uh, the operating system uh, and the apps it came with. So you have only left 4 gig or maybe less. And in order to install all the apps that you like and um, enjoy your box, you need to add uh, a USB storage to your box so you can enjoy your box and the box will work smooth with no issues. So. I'm gonna show you guys what you need to do to fix this problem today. And I hope you leave uh, comments and any questions you are more than welcome. And I can help always to fix your issues. And uh, don't forget to leave like for the video if you like it and subscribe to the channel. And please don't forget to subscribe to the channel. That's most important so you can receive uh, all the new uh, videos I upload and uh, active the bell so you will get the first uh, on uh, all the new videos that I upload so I'm gonna start with this first this is where because most of the people be making um, uh, mistakes so don't plug this extension on the bottom here you have to plug it on the side of the dangle so you, you come here and you plug it, you push it like that, and it's already in. And then this is our USB. I have two gig and I have 32 gig. I already uh, plugged it on the TV here. So you put this one in and it will be like that. And then you have your power supply in here. And of course, this one go to the HDMI uh, in the back of the TV. So like that, I'm gonna show you for the next what you need to do. So here's the bit about before of that, stay tuned, we'll come back. Okay guys, we're back. Now uh, we have to go to the setting, we'll get up from my YouTube I will go back to the setting so the setting is that little wheel on the right side of your TV so you click OK and you come to device preferences and then you come to the storage and here is the USB that I add to my box so you will be able to see here. This is the internal storage. That's the external. So the internal, it has already 4.5 gig. And I'll click on that to see how much space we have. It's only available for two gig uh, point one. And I have extra storage in here so every time you watch a movie or anything it's gonna go straight to this extra storage so you don't have to worry about the internal storage and 
another thing that I want to show you guys but before that I'm gonna turn this one off for the developer option and I will show you how you can activate that so in order to activate the developer option so you can get more tricks and uh, secrets of this box you go to about and then you come down to the build and you keep clicking until it says that you already have developer option so now it says you are no a developer you go back and then you're gonna find it here developer options so you click on the developer option and you go down you keep going down 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 and you find window animation skill what is that for this is to make uh, your applications opening faster and it's not gonna you're not gonna have no debugging or lagging or anything like that so you click OK and then you go on the animation scale 0.5x and then you go down you do the same thing for tr transition animation scale and then you go to animator duration scale same thing so all these three you put them on 0.5x now you can do the reboot or it, you can just go back and it should be good no problem about that so now guys uh, one one another thing that you, you can do is you can go to the setting you go to the apps you go to uh, see all apps and then you can go to for example the cinema HD you go like this and then clear cache remember don't clear the data but clear only the cache that's all what you need so you can make your box working faster and smooth so the cache okay and then after that it's supposed to go back to zero and if you don't want some applications that are bothering you and keep showing on your screen here you can come simply to fire for example Hulu and we can come and go to I already have it on uh, yeah, I already cleared it. I already have it on uh, disabled. So let's say this one, for example. Yeah, it's already on the. Yeah, I already moved it on this box. So, for example, I want to took off the STB MU. I'm going to click OK and then look for. It should say something here about uh, disable or enable that's for the application that come already with the box and if you want to do that you have to just hit disable and you will see it in disable area 